Hi everybody! It's hot outside. To say today is going to be the hottest day of the year. We're going to give you some hot weather gardening tips to help you along the way. Tomatoes, right here, are a wonderful crop. But I will tell you what, one of the most important things you can do right now is to get the foliage off the ground. The reason being is there's a disease called late blight that can cause for a lot of fungal issues and cause for your tomatoes to melt down. Here at Mark Rivers Landscaping, we've staked all of our tomatoes and we're in the process of getting them all tied up. I would also recommend that everybody be applying fungicides to their tomato plants as well as their peppers and other vegetables for the simple fact is because of late blight. This humidity that we're having right now is really rough on plants. Now we're going to take a look at some of the things that you need to be thinking about Come on, Shauna. Shauna, by the way, is our camera person today, and she's doing an excellent job. We're going to walk backwards here, and hopefully I won't trip over myself. We're going to talk about some of the things that you need to be doing right now when it comes to watering your plants. Um, last night here on the farm, we got about three-tenths of an inch of rain, which was wonderful. But we'll lose that much with these kind of, kind of temperatures. So if you are watering your plants, keep in mind that 4 a.m. to 10 a.m. is the ideal overhead time, and that's where we're applying water overhead. If you're doing what we call drip irrigation, which I'm going to show you here in a minute what drip irrigation is, you can water pretty much any time that you want. Now, drip irrigation is a very simple, easy, effective way to bring water to plants. The key is, is that when you do drip irrigation, those plants need water at a very slow pace. And you can deliver that by a lot of different systems. And what we use here on the farm is actually a very simple thing that you can buy yourself at the local hardware store, which is actually what we call soaker hose. And soaker hoses are a real green friendly product that simply is made from remanufactured or reblown tires. And when we have the water on, like this ran water all last night, it drips off the water very slowly and puts the water right to the where the plant needs it, which means that you can irrigate 24/7, seven days of the week. Well, folks, thank you so much for joining us, joining me for this hot weather tips here on UStream with Gardening with Mark Weber. You can catch free broadcast at GardenTalkBlog.com. I'd like to thank Shauna for a great job of being our videographer today, and thank you all, and make sure all your gardening you make is happy gardening.